Hi everyone, welcome to Inside IUE Sports. I'm your host, Travis Lang, and it's okay if you hate running just like I do, because we have somebody that actually loves it. I'm here with uh, first season, second time, head coach of the Red Wolves cross country team, Adam Mengel. How are you doing today, Adam? I'm doing well, thank you. So let's talk about highly, highlights from last year. Um, what were the big moments of last season? Um, you know, the, the highlights from last year, there was just so much good stuff that happened on, on really both sides of, of the cross country programs, men's and women's. Um, they're, they're two separate teams, but um, just, just how well they did um, a, as a team and, and as a program. Um, was was really great. The improvement from 2017 to 18 was was exponential. Last year, we had our, our fastest teams ever on both sides. Um, we had the best records that either program had ever had. The women had their best place finish in the conference at second last year. Um, so we had a lot of, of really exciting stuff, and and I'm really looking forward to this year. So I mean, with great potential moving into this new season. Um, already a great start um, as a first year coach, you move into your second year. Uh, what are you looking forward to about this new season? I think you just said it right there and the word is potential for, for both sides. Um, you know, we had our first workout back yesterday, last night, and um, I was really impressed with how the kids came back, uh, how strong they're looking at this stage of the game. and. Um, like you said, the, the potential um, that, that is there. It's there for both teams to do better, to be faster than they were last year. Um, we're a little bit more experienced with veteran runners on both sides this year in, in the cases that we have more of them. Um, and we have a lot of great new talent that we added to the team in the, in the freshman classes. So um, I think that, that the potential is there to definitely improve upon what they did last year. And I'm really excited for for, to see how that plays out. So really briefly talking about the players, uh, when you talk about you have some veterans, but now you have some uh, new talent. I mean, how are the kids feeling about this upcoming season? They're all really excited. Um, and I think last night really, really got them going and really showed them where we stand as, as teams and, and the improvement from, you know, the returning runners from last year to this year. Um, the freshmen came in and, and they had some great performances in this first workout. Um, for the, on the men's side, it's always a bit of an adjustment for the freshman guys going to race 5K from five miles. But in looking what they did last night, I, I think that they're going to all be just fine. And um, yeah, pretty excited. And finally, if you could answer the sentence for me, the year will be a success if? The year is successful in, in cross country if everyone improves. If you're improving on your times um, from season to season, year to year, then, then that's considered an a success. If you're getting your personal bests, I'm, it's hard to ask for much more than that. Um, so if everyone is improving this season um, in their own personal records, that's going to make the team overall exponentially better. And that's, that's really what you can ask for as a, as a coach. And that's what's going to drive the program forward. So that's, that's what uh, the answer is. <laughs> well, you just heard it from Adam. He's excited for the new year. Coming up, we're going to have some interviews with some players. And you'll get to meet them right here. We'll be right back after a short break. I have had the pleasure of taking care of probably 35,000 cataract patients. It really is meaningful to people. It changes their lives. It gives them back things that, that they hold dear. It seems like you can't do anything without proper banking help. I've had a very good experience working with First Bank. You have people that you know and you grow a relationship with. I just have the confidence that the banking part of it will be okay. What can I do for you today? My throat's been hurting all day and I have class in an hour. Okay, let's get you feeling better. Receive quality care without the wait. Read Health Now right beside you. Hi, how can I help you? But my daughter has a fever and she isn't feeling well. Okay, let's get her feeling better. Receive quality care within the comfort of your own home. Read Health Now right beside you. I'm Abby Bittner. Um, I 
live in St. Leon, Indiana. It's like super close to Cincinnati, Ooh, you know. Um, I'm a sophomore on the cross country team. I am looking forward to uh, making a lot of friends because I wasn't on the team last year, so that's exciting, but yeah. Season goals, um, I would like to see if I can get down to my PR of 1901 um, from high school, so yeah. Why did I choose IU East? I chose IU East because it's close to where I live um, and it's really affordable and IU. My name is Brandon Wright. I am from West Alexandria, Ohio. Um, I've chosen IU East uh, because I love the smaller campus feel. Uh, I think it's a really good environment for me to be in and it's very close to home. Um, some of my team goals and individual goals I would like for the season. Um, I really would like to uh, run a sub 29. I feel like that will be a good accomplishment for me and to help the team further in the future. And from my team goals, uh, I would like to uh, get top three in, in, our, in our conference. Uh, what I'm most looking forward to this season is honestly just traveling, uh, just getting to know my teammates more, making new friends along the way. I feel like that would be a good environment and a great future for me. My name is Brooke Pereira. I am a junior here at IU East and I'm from Greenville, Ohio. Um, I'd say my favorite cross country memory was uh, getting second at conference last year because that's the highest we've ever scored in IU East history and that was just a big accomplishment for everybody and then just traveling and being with everybody. It was a lot of fun. Favorite coach saying, um, he says uh, toodles <laughs> whenever you hear me. It's, it's really, really funny if you ever hear him say it. It's awesome. And he says yens too, but instead of y'all, he says yens and very funny as well. Um, what am I most looking forward to this season is our team's pretty young. We have a half our team are, are freshmen or um, people that haven't ran cross country last year. So I'm getting excited or looking forward to meeting everybody and getting to know everybody. And then also just um, getting healthy again and hopefully be able to race by the end of the season. So that's what I'm looking forward to. Uh, my name is Chance Klostein. I went to Arcanum High School and I am a sophomore at IU East. I chose IU East because it was affordable. It was pretty close to home and I just enjoyed the atmosphere of the campus. Um, my goals for this season would be to get a PR, hopefully break into the low 27s and just help my team as much as I can. And this season I'm just looking forward to spending more time with the guys on the team and just having fun with everyone. Hi, my name is Claire Meyer and I'm from Eaton, Ohio. Um, my pre-race routine and rituals include just, you know, chilling myself out because I tend to, you know, work myself up and get really nervous. And um, I like to just set aside some time to really reflect on what I've done in the past and think about what I want for the future. So um, my season goals for, um, you know, the team would of course to be uh, to maintain that second place in the River States Conference or possibly even shoot for first. That would be amazing. Um, I'm looking forward to uh, most of the season, just building really good relationships with my teammates and watching each other grow and get better. And you know, I, I just can't wait. Thank you. Hello, my name is Emily Cruz. I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico, and this year I'm going to be a sophomore. So I'm going to start off by saying my favorite coach, um, Mengo Sang, and it's actually really funny because we were like in the gym, and he was like, uh, "Well, I don't know how to say goodbye to you, so I'm just going to say toodles." And it's going, it's going to be a year now. And um, my pre-race routine 
is kind of like starts by the day before when I start like watching movies, eating pasta, and while I'm on my way to the race, I start like hearing music and getting in the zone. Um, my season goals this year is like for the whole team to stay in position and get the second place that we got this year. And um, overall, I want my team to be kind of the best and just keep making history. Yeah. My name's Gabe Carter. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky. I'm a sophomore on IUE's cross country team. My pre-race rituals are listening to music and watching Without Limits. <laughs> uh, a season goal of mine will be to run uh, under 27 minutes and a team goal is to make the top three in conference. Um, what I'm most looking forward to in this season is to just travel with the guys and just spending time with them. Hi, my name is Johnny Fike. I went to Bradford High School and I'm a sophomore on the cross country team. One of my pre-race rituals is just to just sit down and just listen to some music and just kind of get in the zone and just get ready for the race. Uh, some season goals for me individually would be uh, to run in under 27 minutes for the 8K and for the team just to place up in conference. Um, my favorite memory from cross country uh, is probably just traveling because we always have a good time on the bus and uh, yeah. Uh, my name is Logan Tuttle. I am from Hagerstown, Indiana, and uh, I am a freshman at IU East. Uh, I chose IU East because it was a, I like to feel of a small community, and uh, the coach reached out to me, and I liked it. Uh, season goals for me would be uh, just to consistently PR, and the same with the team, everyone consistently PRing. And I am looking forward to making memories with the team. I'm from Arcanum, Ohio, and I'll be a sophomore in this year at IA East. Uh, my goals this year for myself is to get low 20s, and as a team, it would be to probably try to keep second place in conference again. Um, I chose IU East because it's a small school and it's close to home. And my favorite IU East cross country memory is probably taking second place at conference last year. Hi, my name is Morgan Schaefer. I'm from West Claremont High School, which is in Cincinnati, Ohio, and I'm a freshman this year. Um, I'm looking forward this season to running at the Wilmington College Jenna Strong Invitational because I've ran on their course several times during my high school career, and it'll definitely be a throwback for me. Um, my season goals for this season are to get under 21 minutes for myself and to place first at a team as a team at the conference championships. Um, my pre-race routines or rituals are before meets, I usually eat a banana or granola bar, depending. So I won't be extremely hungry and I wear sweats and bring a blanket. During warm-ups, I'll usually run for about 10 minutes and stretch with my sweatpants and hoodie on and listen to music and jam out. Then we'll usually do a team break and stand in our team box and I'll jump in, a, in the air about three to four times for good luck and not to get all the nerves out. Hi, I'm Natalia Meza. I'm a freshman, I'm from Rushville. Um, I think being a student athlete is important because um, I like to meet new people and it gives me an opportunity to see how it's going to be running in college and um, I think it would just be a fun experience to do. I chose IU East because they had a really good program here for my major, what I want to do, and 
um, running. I thought running in college would be awesome. So. Uh, season goals for uh, for me, I would personally like to get under 22 minutes. And for a team, I would just like to <laughs> get first in conference. I'm Robert Vasquez, I'm from Norwalk, Ohio, and I chose IU East because it's a smaller campus. Um, one of my pre-race ritual, rituals is just to listen to music and just chill out. And then I'm most look, looking forward to this season is hanging out with the guys and just getting to know them better. Uh, hello, my name is Salvador Campos. I'm from Ligonier, Indiana. I'm a senior on the cross country team and chose IU East because it was a very affordable school, offered a lot of good programs, had what I wanted, and the coach reached out to me. So for my races, I like to eat pancakes and uh, just relax with my friends. That's pretty much all I do. And I'm looking forward to playing, getting to make some big plays this year. That's what players do. Hi, my name is Savannah Hart. Um, I'm from Marion, Indiana, and I'll be a sophomore this year. Um, the reason why I choose IU East is because it's a perfect distance from home and the people were just really inviting. I just felt comfortable there. Um, my favorite Coach Mingle saying would also be toodles because that's just his silly way of saying goodbye to us. <laughs> Um, my season goals, um, for our team anyways, would be to hold our second place spot in the conference or maybe even win it also. That would be awesome. <laughs> and then individually, um, I just would like to improve my um, PR this year and possibly make it to nationals. That would be really cool. My name is Shannon Milnickel. I'm a sophomore on the IU East cross country team. Uh, my goal for the season is to run under 26 minutes in the AK. And my goal for my team is for everyone to run individual PRs. I'm most excited for this season to spend time with my best friends and uh, have a good time. My name's Zach Barkle. I'm from Moreland, Indiana. I'm a sophomore. Um, so my pre-race rit ritual is like taking an ice bath before every race. And then I'm mostly looking forward to like getting to know all like new freshmen and just seeing what this team can do this year. And then season goals, obviously I want to PR, be 27 minutes, and then want the team to move up in conference this year. 